35 years ago, Nintendo released the first Super Mario Brothers and made video game history. And to celebrate this landmark anniversary, we asked fans young and old about their first Mario memories. I was only like four or five when I played my first Mario game, but I was immediately hooked. And Mario made me fall in love with video games. I remember getting the first sales report when the first Mario came out and my jaw dropped. We broke every industry record on the first day of sales. Jake and I rode our bikes to Target to buy Mario 1 and we rode so fast home. <laughs> We're like passing cars like, move people, we gotta play Mario. Never pedal fast. Yeah, well maybe too fast because Jake got like major air off this little jump off and when he hit the ground, he missed the seat and he landed with all his weight onto the crossbar and he like demolished his nuts. <laughs> I didn't demolish him. Yeah, you did, dude. They popped. Popped? Not even a, the most random guy I've ever met. <laughs> My first Mario memory is that music. No. Do, 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 no. Do, do, dude, do, no. Do. They definitely popped, dude. We heard them pop, dude. You screamed, they popped. Okay, okay. They popped. They, popped. <laughs> they, they did. Okay. <laughs> Point is, Mario's an amazing game. <laughs> I'm trying to forget me, I'm at a loss for words after that horrifying story about that man's nuts. Uh, maybe we should let the dust settle on that before I start talking about Mario Mania. I remember the first time I found the war zone. I was so, I'm sorry, they heard them pop? <laughs> You remember the day you beat Mario 1? Ah, uh, yes. Hey, were we at my house or your house? I uh, we were in the hospital, actually. Um, Jake was recovering from surgery to, like, I guess, rebuild his nuts. Uh, but it was unsuccessful. It wasn't unsuccessful. Yeah, it was. Uh, they told Jake it was like trying to put a watermelon back together after it was dropped up a 10-story building. Yeah. Back to Mario, though, greatest of all time. Uh, Jake said it was the only thing that made him forget they had to remove his nuts. <laughs> Stop talking about that, bro. <laughs> Please change the order so I don't have to directly follow them to. I beg you, I can't wax nostalgic about Mario one second after hearing about how that boy was neutered. <laughs> No, thank you. <laughs> More Mario adventures followed, but one shattered records and set a new standard for games, Super Mario Brothers 3. The day Mario 3 came out is burned into my memory. <laughs> Mario could fly. I was back in the hospital, actually. <laughs> was I? Yeah, uh, you had that emergency surgery. There was an infection and they had to remove everything from Jake's groin and what was described, I guess, to me at least, as a sanding down of his pelvic area. I don't remember them saying sanding down. Yeah, they did. Uh, I walked into Jake's recovery room with Mario 3 and he said, It's on. No, you said nothing's down there anymore. I'm smooth like a Barbie. I'm smooth like a Barbie. I'm smooth like a Barbie. Hey, where did you come up with this stuff? <laughs> you said it. <laughs> But when Jake was playing Mario 3, his mind was on saving the princess, not on being sanded down. <laughs> Let's stop saying sanded down, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> we played Mario 3 nonstop. We were Mario Maniacs! We, <laughs> we played every day, except the days uh, Jake had physical therapy to relearn how to pee. Wasn't a big deal. Well, it kind of was. Uh, Jake now pees through a small hole just below his belly button. So he has to lie horizontally, <laughs> face down. And in order to pee, he basically has to plank the toilet. How do you guys have a picture of that? I'm just curious. But through it all, uh, Mario was there. And Mario's still here, making us smile again and again. Where will this air exactly? <laughs> It was a simple request. I do not wish to follow them two, and yet here I stand, order unchanged, expected to do the impossible. Go to hell. Happy 35th anniversary, Mario. With you, the fun never pops. I mean, stops. That's sorry.